Hello, today's shave is going to be with a gem open comb micromatic. My soap is going to be the B Pure. I've been using this Dollar Tree soap quite a bit. My uh, aftershave is going to be Aqua Velva. I really like it. I like the smell. I like the alcohol content in there and, uh, and the menthol. If you get any cuts, it lets me know. Uh, also, my pickup pass I'll be doing with the Dickinson's Witch Hazel. And before we get on the shave, I want to show you the progress that I'm making with uh, this Schick injector I'm putting a handle on. If, uh, for you guys that are that don't know, this is uh, with a Schick injector, it has a tang with a ferrule like this. This is mostly the E's and the G's. I don't know if any other models have this kind of attachment system, but I made up a cedar. This is red cedar handle. I'm going to be attaching this with some epoxy. I'm going to be putting some finish on here and I will have a shave. This is a G1. I'll be doing a review with it at some point. I had a cracked handle on it. So let's get on to the shave here. Just want to tell you guys about that project. Hope your uh, 4th of July weekend was well. Mine was good. Use the brush. I've seen a couple guys do that to put water on their face. They use a brush. I gotta be careful. I had some beer brats and was, I didn't know it until I uh, got it and started eating them. So uh, my skin's a little broke out. I'm gonna be using this like a um, like a shave stick. I like that method. Each to their own. You want a bowl lather, bowl lather. You want a face lather, face lather. Neither here nor there. It's all wet shaving the same. That's my view on it. Whatever uh, works for you. Now, this Micromatic, when I first got it, I uh, I went on and I uh, looked at all the videos on it because I heard it's quite aggressive. So I, uh, what I was told in videos is try to keep this angle as much flat to your face as possible. Just some people lift up a little bit. I haven't been that. <laughs> I haven't been that adventurous yet. We'll say that. I really do like this Be Pure so doesn't taste very good, but <laughs> in fact, I went and I got some, uh, I don't know if I told you guys in my last video, I went and got three more pucks of it, because uh, Arco is the cheap, next cheapest thing for me around here, and uh, yeah, I'm not paying uh, to get free shipping 20, what is it, 25 bucks, I've got a, um, CVS Carbon Blade loaded up in this. Give it a try. First pass. I have not been getting a lot of life out of these blades. I may be getting five shaves if I'm lucky. I have some uh, stainless blades that came with this. Oh, I got a blemish right there. Of my gems, this one's my favorite. And I'm only going to be doing about two passes with a pickup.
gonna be a little slower than usual. I'm not as confident with this <laughs> with this one as I am, say, a uh, injector. Well, I like uh, aggressive razors. The only one, <laughs> and one I can say that I don't like is that shovel head I have. It's aggressive, and it don't cut for uh, for crap. <laughs> I think the head is messed up on it. I really do. Uh, ever ready all right I'm not complaining though I only paid four bucks for it so all right second pass a little water Should have done this uh, yesterday on Micromatic Monday, but I want to get a couple of days of growth for you guys, so. All right. Try grain. I don't feel comfortable going side drain on under my uh, upper lip with this thing yet. So I just do. I'll try a little bit. Ain't too bad. No. I'm testing today. This lather's thinning out. Well, it seems to be holding slick. Get up here. All right, anything I missed, I'll get up with the pickup pass with the uh, witch hazel. Pretty crappy weather here lately. It's been raining. I know you guys in the south it's been pretty hot lately. It was here last week too in the north. Alright. Witch hazel. Bad spots.
<laughs> not bad. Not a lot to get on their pickup pass, I'll tell you that. <laughs> not bad. <laughs> wow. You guys saw my last trade with the injector. I had a lot more to get with a pickup pass. This is a very efficient razor. Alright. Aqua Velvet. Good stuff. Hey, look at that. No irritation. It's only on that blemish I got. But that's I, that's the alcohol hitting that. <laughs> Not a bad shave. Wow. Definitely uh, can recommend you uh, getting one of these. Wow. If you like a uh, uh, razor with blade feel, this is a way to go. I have a uh, hat. What do I have? This is my third, second or third shave. I'm not totally certain. I've got so many razors. You have to forgive me. I go between them all. But uh, I've not had a bad shave with this yet. And it's it's pretty cool. Let me take the blade out. I'll show you guys real quick. When this thing closes, it, it pushes the, the, um, the head of the razor actually pushes forward, which is kind of neat. And this thing's just Art Deco all over. It's from that era. I mean, they just don't make stuff like this anymore. And these are the cheapest things I've found on eBay. I think I paid, what, seven bucks for this with uh, some gem stainless blades that came with it. <laughs> you really can't beat these. Uh... I wouldn't uh, recommend it for a beginner, though, because uh, if you lift up on, uh, if you instead of going like this, you go like that, oof. It's gonna, you're gonna have some, uh, it's gonna be aggressive. So it's not a thing for someone that doesn't have technique. That's my, what I say. I know others will say, oh, well, go with an aggressive razor, go with a mild razor. You choose. <laughs> you choose. You watch everybody on YouTube and you choose. So, nope, uh, good shave. Like I said, I hope you had a good uh, 4th of July. I've got a Gillette Tech to review for you guys, and I'm going to finish up the project with this, and I'll be doing a shave. This is a G1, cleaned up real nice. I've also got a walnut handle for it, but uh, I like this one a lot better. I um, went with a G8 length handle. It's a quarter of an inch longer than the um, the regular handle, and it just it came out nice. It's not finished yet, obviously, but... I will have a video up shaving with this probably next. So, thank you for watching. I appreciate you guys for watching my videos and subscribing. If you have any comments or questions, comment down below. And happy shades, and I will catch you guys later. Bye.